That couldn't happen to me, right? It's the thought Candy Morrison says went through her mind here at Janif Shopping Center about a year ago. She was shopping and she felt uneasy. Some man ended up chasing me home and he actually was following me in the store, but I couldn't find any security inside to follow me out. So I tried to break and hope that I would miss him and he found me. So he chased me home. So now I, when I come through, I make sure I look around the area. A newfound awareness. Police say we should all have when we're out shopping and vulnerable to thieves or anyone looking to hurt us. We just left the store, restaurant, wherever we're going to be during the holiday shopping season. We're heading to our car. What are some things we got to be watching out for as we take this step? Well, really the big thing is situational awareness and the definition of that is knowing what's going on around you. That is the big number one thing. You've got to know what's going on around you and you cannot be distracted. Got to get the face out of the cell phones. Got to know what's going on in the earbuds too. That's one of the big things. And what are you going to be looking for? So let's start walking. What are we looking for? What are you watching okay. for as we go to the car? So what we're doing is as we leave the building or as we leave the store, make sure you absolutely know where you park. There's so many people leave a business or a store and don't remember where they're parked. So they have their packages in their hand. They get out to the parking lot and they kind of got the face looking, where did I park? And, and if you notice, I'm kind of looking around. I'm looking at vehicles. I'm seeing if anybody's kind of looking at me. So we've, we've made it to the car here now. So before you get in the car and, and drive off, what are what are you going to be? One last look around? Uh, absolutely. I'm going to look around. Like I said, I'm, I'm particularly paying attention to see if there's anybody parked next to me in a vehicle, possibly that's running. I just want to make myself aware, does this person have bad intentions or what have you? If I feel that they do, I may go back to the store. Stores have security guards, extra, sometimes extra security during the holiday season. Would you mind walking in my vehicle to make sure I get to my vehicle safely? And police say where you park can make all the difference too. When you go up to the store, maybe try not to park in the back of the parking lot or on the top level of the parking deck if you can, because you don't want to isolate yourself. So when you go back to your car, someone can see that as an opportunity and realize, hey, there's no one else around here. No one will watch me commit this crime. So just something to think about as you head out for the holiday shopping season. And really, when you head out uh, any day during the year, we're going to have much more coming up for you uh, later on WGNT. We're live in Norfolk, Anthony Sabella, News 3.